What's going on guys, Arrow here, and today I have some more information about Nintendo's next new system, the NX. So let's take a look at the article I have right here. It comes to us from Wii U Daily, and it says Nintendo NX will support Unreal Engine 4, and that this is still a rumor, and we don't have any confirmation yet, and Nintendo still has yet to show us what the NX really is. So all the information we are getting right now for the NX does just come from rumors and leaks and speculation and you know Nintendo patents and other sort of information but this article says that the new Nintendo NX rumors are now emerging and they suggest that it will indeed be a very modern console and this is great because this is something I really want on the Nintendo NX I really want it to be a modern console that's more powerful than the PS4 and the Xbox One because you know the NX is going to be coming out after the PS4 and Xbox One have already launched so you don't want the P uh, the NX to be less powerful than them because that just shows that Nintendo doesn't care about their hardware and you want if you want your console to be more powerful if it's coming out after the PS4 and the Xbox One to show that Nintendo does care about their hardware and their power. Also, it says that the Nintendo NX will support the Unreal Engine 4, the new engine from Epic Games that's used by many third-party games. So if Nintendo is implementing this into the NX, we can assume that they really do want to go for the third party this time around, and that they want to get as many third-party developers as they can. So that's really good. Thumbs up for Nintendo for doing that. And it also says the rumor comes from the same developer who previously said that a graphically impressive PS4 game is being ported to the NX. So I guess we can say that the source is kind of credible as well. And it says in addition to the Unreal Engine 4, the NX supports the newest versions of the Unity engine as well. And that Unity is a popular engine for small indie games. So I guess Nintendo wants the small indie games as well. Or that's that's good and then it says the source also says that Nintendo dev kits are limited right now and that there's a big demand for the kits so that's really impressive so it looks like dev kits are being um, uh, given out right now too and that they are limited so that's, that's good um, a lot of people are getting their hands on the dev kits uh, Nintendo is shipping a software development kit instead which preps game developers or game makers to make games on the NX. We previously heard that the NX is as powerful as the Xbox One, so that's good. I mean, I, I kind of want the system to be more powerful than the Xbox One, but if it's, you know, on par with them, that's fine. I mean, I just don't want it to be underpowered, you know? Uh, getting popular engine support is a big deal when it comes to attracting third-party developers and publishers. In addition to the Unreal Engine 4, some of the other popular engines are the Frostbite engine, which is used by EA. Um, okay. The Wii U didn't support the Unreal Engine 4, nor the Frostbite engine. Okay. So this is showing that the Wii U didn't support the Unreal Engine 4 or the Frostbite engine here, and that it's saying that the NX is going to be supporting these. So I guess we can say that the NX is going to be somewhat similar to the Xbox One and PS4, because it's not going to be as diverse as how the Wii U was. Um, you know, because the uh, PS4 and the Xbox One are similar to each other, because, you know, it's the same, you know, console that's hooked up to the TV with the controller, with the two joysticks and, you know, the four buttons and everything. It's really, they're really similar to each other. Whereas the Wii U, you know, you got the two screen experience with the two joysticks and, you know, the D-pad and it's just, it's much more, um, you know, diverse than the ps4 and the xbox one because those two controls are uh, controllers are very similar to each other but you know i still love my wii u you know i love playing smash brothers and splatoon all the way i'm just saying that looks uh, that from looking at this article if the nintendo nx is going to have the uh uh, the Unreal Engine 4, then we can probably assume that it's going to be, you know, a similar console to the Xbox One and PS4, but of course, it's made by Nintendo, so we're going to see some sort of creative twist to it, and that's what I'm looking forward to the most, because I really want to see what Nintendo is going to do with this system. They're definitely not just going to put a standard console with, you know, a controller and a, um, and uh, the console that hooks up to the TV. There's going to be some sort of twist that only Nintendo could come up with, on this system and that's what I'm really looking forward to seeing but yeah guys that's pretty much the video here it looks like Nintendo is finally going for that third party support which they really need in their games and yeah I'm really looking forward to that so please be sure to drop a like on this video subscribe to my channel if you want some more news on Nintendo NX as well as just other fun Nintendo games and yeah guys I will see you guys in the next video thank you so much for watching